please, please, please tell your friends, tell everybody. But when I thought about quilts, I said to myself, what would be better than to welcome the Obama family to our city with just something to keep you warm? Yes. All right? Yes. Now, where is Darnette Cooper? Where is she? Oh. She, she's a member of my quilting group, the Daughters of Dorcas and Son. This is Miss Cooper. She's from Jamaica, but she's one of the top lawyers for the district. Okay. This sister called me after I didn't have no room for nobody else's quilt. And she said, I think you want to see what I'm doing. I was sitting at the table trying to design a quilt to open this exhibit with at the time. She took me into a bedroom, and the center of this quilt was laid on the bed. I said, can you expand that seven or eight feet? And she said, well, I said, I want to use it as the opening to my exhibit. So this is the brains, this is the artist, this is the lawyer. Wonderful lady. When I told her I was having trouble raising money, she said, well, I raised a lot of money for Obama. Let me try to help you. The next day, I got a call from Busy B. Some of y'all know Busy B. She's one of the top promoters of artists in the whole metropolitan D.C. area. Her last name is Britton. Yes. yes. Without Miss Britton's initial help, this exhibit might not have happened. So I want to give all praises to her. She's the one who made this reception happen. All right? And so it's when it's grassroots people in the community, and she come out of that eighth ward where a lot of y'all never been. You understand? You see? So you gotta understand that. So this is the people's thing. So if you have any connection with the Obama family, please let them know this is here, and they can bring their children here like they take them to the Lake Memorial. Okay? So that's, that's it. That's all I got to say. Enjoy the exhibit. And please be gentle because I'm tired. <laughs>